Hill, Tennessee, it's an auto robber. Hey, this is Larry Price again with On the Road with Cars for Kids, and we got some special people here. You need to uh, be interviewed and listen to what they got. I'm Joey Bailey from Cookville, Tennessee. Kenneth Mahan from Cookville, Tennessee. We're Hazard Life, and we're down here in Murfreesboro today. We got invited by uh, Short Mountain Distillery to come on down with the Dukes of Hazard cars. We got the General Lee, the Dixie Jeep, and the uh, Hazard Life Roscoe car. And we're down here having a good time, getting the word out about uh, Hazard Life and things we do. A couple years ago, we went up to Trenton, Alabama. There was a E4 tornado that uh, wiped out a town up there, and a little boy was salvaging through some of his uh, things, and his mom asked him what he was looking for, and uh, he said his Duke's a Hazard shirt. So word got out on Facebook, and... Uh, uh, people started sending merchandise, John Schneider, Ben Jones. Uh, we even ran into the stunt coordinator for the Dukes of Hazard called Tom Cemento and took a trunk load in the police car and a trunk load of merchandise in the General Lee and took it on up to Trenton, Alabama. The little boy had no idea it was coming. No one told him. We met him at a church and we pulled up blowing the horn open up the trunk and the boy was surprised he he was kindly speechless and uh, his long dream was to ride in a general lane this man right here loaded the boy up in the car and drove him around he had a great time riding in it he said he'd never rode in a general lane and that had been one of his dreams was to ride in a general lane so between the ride and the merchandise that we took up for him and the cars that was there we also had the cooter tow truck up there with us and uh, the little boy just had an excellent time. We've did uh, benefits for Children's Miracle Network uh, with John Snyder. John Snyder sent autographed items and stuff to auction off there. And we just stuck doing stuff for the children and just making them all have a good time. And it works out great for everybody. You know, our cars have been autographed by the uh, Act actors. Yeah, uh, the Jeep has actually been ridden in by Catherine Bach herself the stunt double she even signed it uh, stunt team from the Dukes of Hazard I mean their cars have history with the cast from the TV show they're not just clones as most people will tag them they're actually cars been used by the cast members uh, music videos we just got finished shooting a video with Colt Ford called answer to no one yeah but we want to thank you boys for what you do you're doing the same thing we do. We just uh, and uh, appreciate you boys doing what you do, and uh, uh, thank y'all for for being up here today. And we'll have a we'll make a good show out of this.
I'm standing here now with Adrian Shelton. Adrian, I think we've met before, hadn't we? Yes, sir, we, we did. We met down in Emerald Coast down in Panama City this year. Uh, he was down and really enjoyed it down there. That was a real good show, wasn't it? I kind of like this one too, and it's a pleasure for me to be able to stand here and, and show your car off a little better than I did in Florida. Uh, tell us a little bit about it. Well, like I say, this truck started out uh, as an old farm wood hauling truck. Uh, back in father-in-law had it. Uh, he passed away, my wife said she wanted to build a truck in his memory, so we started on it and here it is, from a three-quarter ton flatbed to what you see now. Looks really good. Uh, I think we've been around the car so far, so we appreciate you being here in uh, Murfreesboro and uh, I hope we'll see you some more sometime soon. Sure, appreciate your time, appreciate you coming by and uh, look forward to seeing you all again. Thank you, we'll see you later. Which one do you like the best? Both. <laughs> both. I like both. all drag, drag racers in and out. Uh, yep. Cool. <laughs> yep. You get rust boys sitting in that Chevron? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> talking to Michelle Adams. She is with a uh, M MD patient and she's ambassador to, to the MDA Association in Murfreesboro, Tennessee in Nashville. I've known her for several years and uh, we've always helped the MDA cars for kids has and we're going to let her tell you a little story. <laughs> Hello, and I'm Michelle. I've had MD since I was born, but was diagnosed at 12 years old. Um, I've been with Cars for Kids for long time. A long time. <laughs> um, I recently have had surgery to be re-diagnosed, and we have a walk coming up in March. Um, Muscles for Michelle is my team's name. And I don't know what to say. Well, you look beautiful today. You look, you, uh, you look good. You're 
pretty girl, and you're gonna be all right. Cause we're gonna help you. We help MDA associations across the southeast United States, Cape Girardeau, Missouri, and here and everywhere. Uh, how old are you now? Twenty-two. Twenty-two. <laughs> I can't believe that. I met her when she was a little baby. I changed her diaper when she was a little baby. <laughs> and uh, she lives here. She lives in Murfreesboro. And uh, been a good, uh, good sport. She's got a good personality. And uh, play something else. Um, it ain't easy. We, 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 <laughs> no, it's not. Um, I don't, I don't go to school yet. You don't go? No, I don't. Not yet. I want to go to TSU in Murfreesboro. Um, I want to be an event, event planner as a career. That would be good for us. Let her plan our events, <laughs> you know. And... <laughs> she don't know. She'd give out, and uh, we're at the uh, Motorama here at uh, Murfreesboro. It's a good crowd, and uh, we'll try to find somebody else to interview lately. <laughs> Just met this fine gentleman here, Mr. John Whiteside. Uh, tell us a little bit about your Cadillac here, John. I well, I, um, I've only had it for maybe about a year and a half, two years. Uh, how I required the car is um, I went to a state sale, <clears throat> excuse me, here in uh, Murfreesboro, and um, it was sitting in the garage with about five inches of dust sitting up under it. And uh, the guy said he just wanted it gone. To, uh, his father bought it for the mother in '76, brand new. And the father passed away, and then the mother passed away, so the car hadn't been driven in over 15, 20 years. And so he came home to, to sell their stuff, and I acquired the car. And um, I've been, I, I had it painted, and I put the wheels on it. So I actually got the cars for my kids. It's really a sharp-looking car you've got here. Uh, you said something about the interior a while ago. Tell, me, tell us about it. Uh, uh, the interior, uh, everything is considered uh, a triple black with the black top, black interior, and black car. The interior is still at its original. I didn't touch none of the, uh, not the steering wheel, seats, or none of that. The floor, all of it is still in Renzo, and, and, and you can probably eat off of it. Well, John, we really appreciate you interviewing with us today, and you really got a sharp looking ride. Appreciate it. Okay, we just met up with a group from the Voodoo Kings out of Hermitage, Tennessee, and we have a young lady here that's with them, pinup model from Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, how about telling us your name and name of your company? Um, yeah, I'm Shannon Million. I'm with Talkopolis, and my television show is called The Rockin' Pinup. <laughs> All right, now we know. Uh, I understand you do car shows with the Kings. I do. I have a lot of friends in the Voodoo Kings, a couple of friends in the Knuckleheads, a few in the Poor Boys. But, um, yeah, the Voodoo Kings are my, my crew that I like to hang out with. That's great that they've got somebody like you to hang with. Uh, we'll bring somebody else over here to tell us a little bit about the Voodoo Kings and see who we can get over here next.
Hello, uh, and your name? My name is Callisto Killer. And who is this lovely lady? This is, uh, this is Pepper McPiston. No, Karen. <laughs> or Karis. <laughs> That's great. Well, you gonna be a pinup model one day too? Mm-hmm. You are? Yes. That's good. Um, do you work with her or are you with the Voodoo Kings or what? You well, my, my husband is a member of the Voodoo Kings and my husband and I have a photography business called You Voodoo Imaging. I do most of the photography and I do work with Shannon quite a bit on various projects. That's wonderful. I, I like the group that you have here today. Let's bring these other two gentlemen in over here and see what we can get going here. Uh, I understand you guys are putting on a show soon. Yeah, our show is uh, first Saturday in October in Bowling Green, Kentucky. It's called the Voodoo Hoodoo. Uh, it'll be our third annual show. It's a uh, really good turnout, good music, good bands, pretty girls, lots of cars, bikes, just a really good time. And you are? I'm King Dado Deluxe. I'm a, a mouthpiece. <laughs> I'm a member of the Voodoo Kings. I host for uh, Music City Burlesque, and um, I'm just a all about man about town here in uh, the... Uh, Nashville metropolitan area. Well, I appreciate you being here. Uh, I forgot to get your name, though. Uh, I'm John West. I'm the, the, the chapter president of Tennessee of the Voodoo Kings. Uh, we're in five states now, Tennessee, Kentucky, Indiana, Ohio, and Illinois, becoming one of the larger Midwest car clubs in the country. And uh, it all goes back to Voodoo Larry up in uh, Chicagoland that started the whole thing about 12 years ago. And uh, it's going really well. Looking to uh, get out and do some hot rod in the spring. Maybe I can bring my hearse to your show and I won't be an outcast, huh? No, sir. You bring it. We're open to all, so it'll be great. Bring it up. Thank you, gentlemen, for the interview. And uh, we hope to see you at your show and some more of our shows. All right. Thanks a lot. Thank you. He's a moonshiner. I've been a moonshiner ever since I was nine, nine years old. Yeah, but I was born in 1926. Who's older? You're older than I am. <laughs> I'm born in 48. And my, oh, my whole family, that's what hey, they were, the moonshiner. You're younger than I am. I was born in 1946. Huh? Well, you're really, I didn't think I'm you were. older than you are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was born in 48. May the 2nd. And I, and I tell you what, I was uh, my daddy and mama uh, on my both sides. They were hit, my mama was, was the oldest one out of 14 kids, and my grandpa, he was all white with moonshine. He had six boys, and they was all white moonshine. And two of them were the moonshine and boot lady. And uh, on my daddy's side, well, they all were moonshine. On I never did know my grandpa. He died when my daddy was about three years old. My daddy said he was three years old when he died. So never, you know, my daddy don't even remember him. But they all drove up. In moonshine, and they had to. They did how much? But we we done we we done all right with it, but we never did. Never did put a lot in the pocket. We you know we rolled. Well, it looked like you eat well. Yeah, eat well. Uh, <laughs> back them days, you know, I was I was, I, I wait about them pretty women fast cars. Yeah, yeah. And that's that, what my money went. Now, and what I, was your name then? Uh, can't say my name too well. It's Ricky. E S T E S. Ricky S. That's it over there. Yeah. I'm the moonshiner. That make moonshine, Ricky Moonshine. <laughs> at, at Chalk Mountain to Tilda. Okay, I ran into Laura and Samantha. Laura shot some pictures with the Cars for Kids car earlier today and find out a little bit about them. Uh, Laura, can you tell us something about yourself and your career? Um, I'm 25 and I work on an ambulance. Full time. And model part time? Yes, as a hobby. As a hobby, okay. And Samantha, how about you? Um, I am an accountant and then I model part time too. So it's good to see y'all at the show today and we understand that this vehicle and the vehicles next to us here are a part of the group that you're with. Is this true? Yes, that's correct. Yes, sir. Dirty rascals. Dirty rascals out of 
Rascals are out of uh, Alabama. Dirty Rascals out of Alabama, okay. And one of the Dirty Rascals is over there taking photographs while we're doing this, so he's having fun, I know. Um, do you know much about the vehicle? It's a 52 Chevy. And it's my favorite. I don't know much about them. 52 Chevy and your favorite. Big block. Big block. Small block. Let's see, I understand you were in a magazine? I was, Rat Rods. With this, with with this, this truck? Yes, sir.